Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. This is an excerpt of a recent power-up webinar looking at advanced audio inside Final Cut Pro 10. In this excerpt, I'll show how you can repair your audio, like removing hum or reducing noise, using audio enhancements. I want to repair audio. For instance, here, I had a, an audio operator that felt the best place to put the microphone cable was right next to the power cable for about 600 feet. So I need to move this. Here's what it sounded like. I think it is. We have what could best be called as hum. Now, when we import a file, we have the ability, when we do the import, to check these three audio options. Analyze and fix audio problems, separate mono and group stereo audio, and remove silent channels. When I do my projects and I do my own importing, I always check these top three options and I check the bottom three options, but I never check video analysis. It just takes too long. It's easier to do later. But the audio analysis is both fast and can save a ton of time because the audio analysis did, in fact, spot the hum problem with this audio. And what happened was it would go up to, when I go to the audio tab, notice under audio enhancements, it says, hey, Larry, there's a problem here. So I say, okay, take me there. So I click the arrow and it says there's hum here. Now in point of fact, the first time that I did this presentation, it removed the hum automatically. So I'm playing this clip and I'm completely speechless because I'm expecting all kinds of hum and I don't hear a thing. That's because it not only heard the hum, it removed the hum. And it just did this, it just turned this hum removal on. Look at what happened to the waveform. There's the hum, there's no hum. Take a listen. I think it is inescapable that whatever success I've had is a side effect of having been trained as a mathematician. Now, I grant you there is a washing machine sound going on in there, and that's the artifact of getting the hum removed. The question is which is better, with the hum? I think it is. Or without the hum and a little bit of washing machine sound? Inescapable that. Now, to be further truthful, if I really, really care about getting rid of the hum, I would move it out of Final Cut Pro 10, move it into um, Adobe Audition, <clears throat> which has got a really great hum removal feature. But sometimes you just don't have the time or you may not own Audition and you want to get the hum gone. That's where the audio enhancements can help. How do you access audio enhancements? There's two ways. We go to the magic wand here, go to Auto Enhance Audio. It'll automatically take us to this screen or Go to the inspector. Inside the inspector, audio enhancements, click the right pointing arrow, and turn on the audio enhancements that you need. Here's another example. Listen to this clip. Absolutely. And we've got, um, we've got too much. Okay. So now with that clip, what I've got is I've got some background noise I'd like to get rid of. Absolutely. And we've now, maybe you like the background noise, and that's why you went on location, because you want the feeling of the actors being in that environment. Perfectly okay. You don't have to remove it. But if you do want to remove it, here's how. Select the clip. See where it says background noise removal. Turn on the blue square. Look at what happened to our waveform. There's the crowd noise at the trade show. And now it's gone. Take a listen. Here's with... Absolutely, and we've got... Um, and here's without. Absolutely, and we've got, um, we've got two Macs in. The best way to think about this is we are not removing noise. We are reducing noise. If we really remove it, it's going to make the, t the voice of the talent sound really terrible. We want to reduce the noise so we can hear the talent more clearly, but not totally take it away. As you grab this slider, this drags such that more of the noise is in or more of the noise is out. So we can use the audio enhancements where it listens to stuff. The audio is too loud. This adds essentially a limiter filter to boost the gain. There's too much noise. It adds a noise removal filter to take it out. There's a hum removal. There are other tools that give us a bit more precision. Audition does a better job of all of these, but it doesn't do a faster 
job, and it doesn't do it integrated inside Final Cut Pro 10. There's times where I just have a single clip, just needs a little bit of processing. Let me just get this in, get it out of here, and don't worry about it. These tools are perfectly okay. They're built on the technology that Apple developed for Soundtrack Pro. This has been an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar, taking a look at advanced audio inside Final Cut Pro 10. If you need to stretch your training dollars, a subscription membership to our video training library saves you a lot of money. Access all of our training videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. More than 500 movies, dozens of hours of training, all in-depth and all up-to-date. Plus, members can attend any of our Power Up webinars for free. Our training covers both Apple and Adobe software. We update it every week, and for more information, visit larryjordan.biz slash subscriptions. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at larryjordan.biz store and look for Webinar 97.